Hi, hi students. I am Dr. Badrinath. Uh, in this video, we will see the IDSP topic. IDSP, Integrated Disease Surveillance Program. In simple words, what we can say, it is nothing but a watching program. It watches the India throughout here, from here to here, from here to here. It watches throughout the India, all the people it watches. What it watches means any disease is entered. What are the actions we have to take? How the disease is spreading? What is the style of a disease? What is the pattern of the disease? Like that, it started watching. Throughout India, it watches all the people. That is nothing but it's so that's why I am saying it is nothing but watching program. Program. It is not a person, it is not a system, it is a program. That's it. Okay, it is not organization. Okay. So the same work, what the, in the movie of this movie, in the Allu Arjun, what he will do in the same in the movie of Badrinath, same. He will watch the, he will take care, he will safeguard the pilgrimage Badrinath. He is watching, carefully watching all the devotees. If any problem comes, he will solve. He will solve. If any terrorist will come into the pilgrimage, immediately he will take action immediately. Those type of actions, see, safeguarding of the entire pilgrimage, the same, the job is for IDSP. In shortcut, we are calling as a IDSP, Integrated Disease Surveillance Program. In our language, common language, we are calling it as a watching program. Okay. So we are studying about the subject of social and preventive pharmacy, also called as a social and preventive medicine. Same. Only name is change, medicine, pharmacy. Okay. The remaining entire thing, syllabus, everything is same for all paramedical courses, including MBBS also. So this is a syllabus here. You can find this uh, integrated disease surveillance program, IDSP. That is today's topic. What we are doing, nothing but watching program, nothing but watchmen. What is the main work of watchmen? Watchmen will do safeguard of the, of the building. The same here also same, but this he is a man, but this is a program. That's it. Okay. So these are the topics what I have covered here. So what is the meaning of uh, surveillance, disease surveillance, IDSP introduction, objectives, functions, flow of information, flow of funds, administrative structure, organizational structure. What is the central government? Uh, central surveillance committee structure, state surveillance committee structure, district uh, surveillance st committee structure, reporting forms, everything that and all we will take. Okay, reporting forms, how to report if any disease enter into the day, how to report, which form you have to follow. I like that. Okay. So first we'll see the surveillance. Everything is sweet and short. Immediately, if you see a test book, there was a three to four kilometers are there. Total matter I saw. Uh, but uh, the students nowadays, they do not have patience uh, to listen uh, one hour, two hours. That's why I made it a shortcut to 20 minutes. Everything, all the key points, very, very important terms. Need not to be write the notes also. You can take a screenshots. That's more than enough. So it is a French word. You can see the French fries. Okay. French word. It is a French word. Surveillance. Surve First, we'll see surveillance only. What is surveillance? The remaining part we keep aside. Meaning one, watching with attention. Watching program, I already told. Watching with, see how he is watching with that. Watching with attention, not simply watching like this. Watching. Looking is different. Watching is different. Watching <clears throat> very carefully. That is attention suspicious doubtful you have to see, uh, get a doubt by, like that you have if anybody enters you have to see them uh, in the way of suspicious authority you have authority to see to watch it so authoritatively you are watching meaning to information for action why you are getting all this information of the things means uh, for action so definition ongoing it is a systematic collection collation okay arrangement analysis Collation means arranging in order. You are keeping in order. Okay. Analysis and interpretation of the data and the dissemination of the information. Those who need to know for them, you are giving the information. Okay. We need the lot of information about the corona. They have gave. The government has given. If you are doing like this, that all will do with the IDSP only. IDSP is giving us suggestions always. Okay. In order to that, Action to be taken. What are the actions you have to be taken? See how the disease is entered here. So this person is watching. Why the disease is this disease entered? Either it is a viral disease or bacterial disease. It is a fungal disease or epidemic disease, pandemic disease. Now disease surveillance. What is this disease surveillance? Disease surveillance is this IDSP, integrated. This is integration. Integration means total. 
from central district level mandal level taluk level to district level district level to state level state level to central level this is called integration from top to bottom from the prime minister to the uh, attender from attender to the prime minister prime minister to the attender the same fashion integration that is also very important that is the meaning of integration three levels are here district level state level central level i will explain you so this disease surveillance idsp is nothing but a epidemiological practice you are practicing the epidemiology you are studying about the disease uh, number of jobs very important jobs is there it determines the incidence of the disease where there was incidence where the disease was origin where it was incidence and the spread of the disease how the disease is spreading geographical distribution how the see now pandemic this is corona how it is spreading population at risk those either older people or younger people or the child people population at risk trend of disease how it is changing double mutation triple mutation like that all the examples not only corona all the diseases for, this is for the program for all the diseases not only one or two trend of the diseases to capture the factors and conditions responsible for the occurrence and the spread of the disease what are the factors that are responsible for the disease conditions those are responsible for the disease okay occurrence of epidemic occurrence of the pandemic okay to evaluate the effectiveness of the intervention all these are the very very important uh, things were done by the disease surveillance here you can see idsp it is supported by the powered by or sponsored by the world bank assisted by the world bank okay it is a disease surveillance scheme what is disease surveillance we have already discussed so this is nothing but a disease surveillance program it is launched in the chatisgarh in the 2004 it comes under the ministry of health and family welfare of india assisted by the world bank main mission is that to strengthen the disease surveillance disease watching in the india that is the main thing disease surveillance is the main, that they have to strengthen this program will strengthen the country by establishing the decentralized only one person cannot watch district level it has to watch taluk level it has to watch india level central level it has to watch everything decent that's why it is called a decentralized uh, state based surveillance decentralized state based here objective one here district based system you will get to establish decentralized district based system of the surveillance okay to integrate again you had to integrate you had to subdivide you integrate okay first you divide central all the states districts taluks and again you have to integrate that is uh, sum up like that idsp this is official logo <clears throat> all see how the integration is there throughout the geography or oh, any disease they will uh, watch it and import or well, they will report it these are all the five functions are there uh, the structure is uh, three units are there central disease surveillance unit csu state disease surveillance unit ssu district disease surveillance unit dsu okay ihip integrated health information platform this is one of the thing uh, this uh, ihip is a segment of idsp only from idsp only this ihip has came what is ihip here i have mentioned this soft copy has launched by union health secretary in 2019 it is a sub program of the idsp and these are the main functions detection and notification of the health event or disease event okay and investigation and confirmation they have to investigate the disease and they have to confirm yes corona is there like that not only corona anything any disease which enters into india it has to start our origin from the india uh, this idsp has to respond its main job collection of the data epidemiological data clinical data laboratory data all the data it has to collect uh, it has to analyze analyze and it has to interpret it okay and the feedback it has to give a feedback to the people we have to feedback to the public so to the central government all government and dissemination of the results this is a flow of information see where all this uh, information they will get if any disease entered into one taluka or to a one person what happen immediately he will go to the primary health care center or to the hospital so these are all the center where the patient for any new disease came directly they will step into this see here step into all this either it may be a following are the basic information centers where the patient information is registered just like a fir first information register in the police station in the same fashion disease will be entered primarily in all the following either it may be a primary health center 
or it may be a certified health care compliance, district government hospital, ESI, municipal, railway or army hospitals, private corporate hospitals, medical colleges, medical college attached hospital, government labs, private labs, pathology labs, nursing homes, government practitioners, private practitioners, anything. They, see, the person must go, the patient must go to them only, any one of them. All the, it is their responsibility to tell to DSU. That is a main job. They should not hide. If you hide means it is a criminal case. So any doctor or any person, they have to respond. They have to give if is there any new thing. They have to report to the district, district surveillance unit. District surveillance unit, it gives the state surveillance unit information. This information they will give to the central uh, surveillance unions. Okay. And program officer will be there. He will coordinate at the district level only. That's it. This is a flow of information from taluk level to district, district to state, state to central. Now, flow of funds. It is a reverse. Funds. Funds. Okay. To run the this central surveillance units, it gives to the state surveillance units. It gives the fund to all district uh, surveillance unit. This is a funds released to individual districts, funds released to individual, fund released to respective states, like that. This is so it is a reverse. Information follows from the basic, okay, whereas it comes from the top, high here, hierarchy. And this is a structure. Either it may be a central unit or state unit or district unit at any level. They have mainly two committees. One is surveillance committee and another one is surveillance unit. The surveillance committee, major policy decisions, review, physical and financial progress, coordination with all relevant ministers, department, organization. This is the main job. Surveillance unit is responsible for implementing the various activities envisaged under the product. So unit is different, committee is different. Like that, you have to divide and the responsibility also divided. Their responsibility is different. Their uh, the ministers call information giving to the uh, respective ministry, respective district. It is a surveillance committee job. The surveillance unit activities, watching. See, central surveillance, it is a part of, uh, it consists of various states. States consist of various districts. So district surveillance units are the part of state surveillance unit. State surveillance unit is a part of central surveillance units. Okay, that's why you have to write within, not it's separate, 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 right? Okay. Yeah, this is a central surveillance committee. <clears throat> See, first one, a chairperson will be there. This is a central surveillance committee. Chairperson will be there. Uh, central surveillance committee chairperson is here. You can see it is a central health and secretary family welfare. This person, very, very important. This person acts as a uh, the health and secretary of this H HSFW. He will be act as a chairperson for Central Surveillance Committee. Okay. And it has to be coordinated with all these are the members of ICMR, Director General of ICMR. ICMR means Indian Council of Medical Research. And a person, that is department, personal director, program director, program director of IDSP. Okay. JS, Joint Secretary of the Family Welfare. And a director of NICD, National Institute of Communicable Disease. So all these are the members. He has to be coordinate with all these persons. That's his job. Okay. And the director of NIB, National Institute of Biologics. Okay. And uh, respective Ministry of Home, Home Ministry. Okay. Member Secretary. Resp all these points you have to write. IMA, Indian Medical Association, Non-Governmental Organization. Okay. And WHO, Medical College, others, uh, World Health Organization. Uh, national program manager like polio, malaria, TB, vaccine, AIDS, all these, uh, he has to be coordinated with the national program manager. Different uh, for each and every disease, one manager will be there. Okay, director general of health sciences, he's a co-chair, very important, chair, co-chair. Okay, this is about the central surveillance. And state surveillance unit, these are the members. Like medical college, state, medical college of state, representative from the home, department of home. Same I am Indian Medical Association representative, state surveillance officer, like member secretary. He is a co-chair. He is a member secretary. Representative from. And who is the chairperson at the state level means state health secretary. Okay. And uh, IDSP state data manager, TBHV state program manager, polio, malaria, same, same structure only, but here all you will you have to write in the state level only. And here you have to write a here in the district level. 
district collector will be act as a chairperson he has a full powers in the pandemic or epidemic full powers full powers okay whatever he said the lawyers or advocate they have to listen anybody any governmental organization it has to follow during the epidemic they have to follow the ias during the election any officer government officer they have to listen the words of ec election commission okay all these are very important in when you are preparing for a groups okay all these are the important thing this is about district surveillance committee and reporting forms there is only three forms are there form yes suspect cases yes suspecting not confirmation probable probability of the disease is more then you have to report the probability this is by the health uh, uh, workers okay sub centers phc ch where p form is available is available here s form is available health workers sub centers suspected case l means lab confirmed cases see here it is a probability it is a suspecting only suspecting probability see the step wise three steps it is a confirm lab means if you have any corona no no probability is there suspect first you will suspect then probability may be there like that you will think oh i touched there or maybe probability then your laboratory is confirmation so form s yes, p l this is a form s yes. need not to be right exam this uh, full structure of this and all right form s yes, where it is available etc and all form s yes. they have to report yeah, reporting format for uh, the health worker has to report to the dsu Uh, the so and so person came, uh, so I suspected uh, this one. Yes, so I suspecting this case. So you please take care of like that. They have to give a report, and this is form P. Uh, weekly report they can give or daily report also. Nowadays they are giving a daily because of the corona they are giving a daily. Okay, if any person has came, uh, they have to probability is there. This this may be probability like that they have to give. and this is a laboratory confirmation so he he confirmed so and uh, so disease like that they will confirm okay so it's a end so ias keep in your mind uh, he is a pandemic or epidemic officer district level he has a full powers that's it whatever he said uh, he he has a powers to suspend the doctors also very powerful all right so i will end my session here in my watch play playlist of my channel you just check it all the subjects